Yo, what's going on, TikTok? What's going on, y'all? Um, welcome back. Let me know if uh, the audio is too loud or something. Uh, I decided to uh, stream on on OBS instead of TikTok Live, just because uh, I don't know, man. TikTok Live, it's like glitching or something. I updated my hard drive. And for some reason, every time I go live, it's just not picking up my PS5 audio. I can hear it on my end, but every time I go live, uh, the audio just doesn't work. So for now, we'll just stream through OBS, which I don't think is that bad. Um, it's just, I don't have the follower roll up and, and things of that sort. Um, but nevertheless, we're still streaming today. Uh, and I think what I'm gonna do is I'm going to pop open the, the chat because it was a lot easier for me to see it when I did that. But if at any time the audio sounds off, let me know. We'll go ahead and adjust it. Um, but yeah, it's gonna be my first playthrough. I've heard great, great things about this game. I'm very excited. I hear this is like one of the best after uh, The Walking Dead. But once we complete uh, Batman, I definitely want to do The Wolf Among Us, which is next. This is so cool. Everybody says this one is so great, and uh, I'm definitely down to try it out once we finish Batman. But um, everyone says they want more of this. Some people argue that they're happy where they left it. But uh, we'll see, we'll see. Um, I just did episode one. Uh, I just down. Okay, it like disconnected for a second. Oh man, I, I love them too. Let me know if at any time there's a problem with the stream, y'all. But yeah, I'm excited. I hear great things about both of them. Um, so I was like, freak it, let's play it. I only downloaded episode one. Uh, so we're just gonna do episode one today, and then after episode one, I do have to start getting ready for work, but I'm really excited, so let's just go right into it. I don't really adjust the slider so the bat symbol is barely visible. Let me say like there. Okay, select a bat tech color. Oh! Kind of digging the yellow though, cause you know he's like, he's like black and yellow. You know what I'm saying? Ooh, I think we're going with yellow. I think we're gonna go with yellow. I kind of wanted to go with purple though. Purple's my favorite color, and it kind of looks sick in purple too. But all right, this game series adapts to the choices you make. The story is tailored by how you play. I'm excited. I heard so many great things about this, so I'm, like, I don't know, I'm excited, like, I love Batman, Batman's probably my favorite DC character, like. Hey, what are you- <gasps> Oh my god! Oh my god, wait, I don't know if I was expecting that off the bat, holy shit. Damn, okay, they're not- they- okay, they're not messing around. They're not messing around. Get it open. On it. Hey, you think he's gonna show? He'll bring the whole goddamn place down. Sorry about the past two days, please we'll be out of here before anyone can stop us. I forgive you, man. <laughs> Just don't be weird, man. This is my moderator. This is my moderators don't play around, and I love them so much. For like always being on their A game. Shout out to my moderators, always. Oh, there he is, the man himself. Oh, man. I love Gordon. The hell? Back. Get back. Oh shit! Oh. Oh 
Holy Gordon. shit. They're on the 52nd floor. I'm going in. Hey, wait! Wait for backup! Don't need it. Take the stairs. That's Batman? I heard stories, you know. Sent three home in an ambulance. The rest in body bags. No wonder the cops want him dead. Hey, you ever seen him? Yeah, Gotham Zoo. Look, Harvey Dent. Oh, there he is. The Bat. Thank you for the like, I appreciate it. Oh shit. Keep doing this. Aww. I have to. <laughs> no one else will. Every drop of blood, everything you've sacrificed, the city is safer now. It's made you Damn. a target. They fucked them up. And Look, people he's... will keep you in the crosshairs until you're shot out of the sky. Criminals in this city. <laughs> they need something they to need fear. They something to fear. Yeah, they fear Batman. Oh fuck! But like, damn, he's really. What the hell happened? Shit. The hell they go? Whatever oh, got they have it. No idea. Don't let it get They're out. They're about to get scared. Ah, they're scared, yo. <laughs> What's that? Oh shit. Right into the dark. I love this. They're scared. What the hell is this? <laughs> oh my god. He's just shooting, bro. He don't even know. I know you're trying to create a myth, but be careful you don't turn into a monster. Sometimes you need a monster. Oh, shit. Come on! Come on! Come on! <laughs> You big boy. Oh, I love this duo. I swear I say this about every duo, but this, this is just so good. Bat, Batman and Catwoman. Oh, come on. Oh, shit. Hell yeah. 
Batman Telltale series. I've been wanting to play this forever, so. I'm glad uh, we're getting into it because this is dope. And I kind of like the animation. It's like comic book. Like, like it's so sick. Be intimidating, you're succeeding. Criminals are becoming a problem. Bro, he's so you, aggressive. So like, police. that whole scene was crazy. Go. Like, oh Just my god. <sighs> Without a scratch. So far. <laughs> oh shit. That doesn't belong to you. I was wondering if we'd cross paths. You broke the law. Here I am. <laughs> Cut the shit. The law. Don't tell me that's why you do all this. Squeeze into a suit, tie on a cape. Most people dressed up like that end up in Arkham. I do this for the thrill of it. I'll show you a thrill. <gasps> Gotta admit it, though. You give a good chase. One day you might actually catch me. Tonight. Don't you know not to corner a wild animal? It's dangerous. Oh, I love her! Let's put you in a cage. <laughs> Bring it, Bat. I love her. Oh, you gonna fire? <gasps> oh, shit. Hard as hell, like, like super hard. Damn. So they're just watching us fight it out. <laughs> Why go to all that trouble for this? Shit! A myth can't be killed. Is she gonna you, run off? However, our flesh and blood. <gasps> God Holy shit! Why the fuck did he shoot? No! Wait! <sighs> Holy shit! I missed, I missed. Oh, what the hell, but he got her? I don't understand. Shit, 
Guess I was wrong about you catching me. Not sure if it was for my sake, or yours. <laughs> Don't struggle or you'll fall! Oh, but that's what you crave. The struggle. I know men like you. Oh, shit. Bye, Bat. <laughs> oh, fuck! Damn, look how she just took off like that. <laughs> I love her. She took it. Step out of the shadows and be Bruce Wayne tonight. Oh, that's a much harder fight. Don't let tombstones be your family legacy. Alfred always looking out for him. Well then. Ooh. Time to save the city. Yo, she is crazy, but I love her. I love her. Welcome to Gotham. We earned a trophy. Heck yeah. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you, everyone. A humble district attorney like myself is not used to such a ringing endorsement. Even one who cut Gotham's crime rate in half. Now, for too long, two this city has burned with corruption and greed under Mayor Hill's authority. But I promise you, a vote for Harvey Dent is a vote to finally put your foot down. And together, we can stamp out the fire and save hey, our great Hey, what's up? State. Thanks for uh, coming on by the stream. Appreciate you. How scared would I be to if fight Batman? Wayne, ten? What the my heck? My campaign's largest ten. backer could have heard a that applause. He out of ten. Like, well, there Batman we is scary. Fashionable and fashionably late, as always. Say hi, Bruce. I love Batman, though. Welcome to Wayne Manor, everyone. My apologies for the late arrival. Oh, not to worry, Mr. Wayne. We've all made ourselves very comfortable. Thank you. Thank you again, everyone, for your unwavering support. Together, we will change Gotham. <laughs> Mr. Wayne, thank you for opening your house to us. Now, I know this is the biggest mansion in Gotham, but I don't think you got lost on your Are you way here. Are playing on PC, Xbox, PlayStation, Where were you? computer? Uh, we're I playing on, uh, the brooding billionaire angle. So the sooner we make nice with the donors, the sooner everyone will leave you alone. Just working the night shift. Yeah, well, then you're pulling a double. No one came here tonight to see me. Some they want to see the Bruce Wayne, am I right? <laughs> they all and love Bruce Wayne. I can Wayne. see him just fine from here. This shouldn't be painful. It's not a kidney stone. It's only a little face time with potential donors. Your face, specifically, with a mouth that's saying, Support Harvey Dent. We're the grease, they're the wheels. And they're rolling in enough cash and votes to help make Gotham a place for families again. We're finishing the drink. Ah, a little liquid courage before facing your adoring public? He didn't mind this his own business. Too, Bruce. Once I've turned this city around as mayor, you'll be a hero for funding my campaign. Now all I need is a decent slogan. Um, little does he know he's already a hero. Makes me sound like a used he's already car a hero. Which, for the record, I have not been since before law school. Put a dent in crime. All right, all right, all right. How about, uh, put a dent in crime? Hmm? Look at you. It's not <laughs> half bad. I'm gonna use that. Bruce, I meant what I said. Together, you and me, we change Gotham. A city free from crime, where children can play in the streets again. That's what I want too, Harvey, but you know how rough it is out there. We have to shake things up to make that happen. Well, we can start with a few hands, hmm? Come on. I'm really digging this because the animation is literally comic book style and it makes me feel like I'm in a comic book, like a Batman comic book, so... So far, I'm really liking it. Pause. Mr. Wayne, I'd like to introduce you to Bob and Regina Zellerbach. Of course I know these two. Hello, Bruce. Regina here is the chairwoman of Wayne Enterprises, and her husband voted for Mayor Hill last time. I'll admit it, Mr. Wayne. I don't know Mr. You're a werewolf? from a pothole on Main Street, but I trust your family. If you believe in Dent, we believe in you. After all, Whoever you support is a reflection on you. And we trust Harvey. someone like you to lead this city to greatness. 
Well, thank you. But we're all here tonight because we want to make a difference. And that's what it's going to take. Every single one of us. Not just me, not just Mr. Dent. Everyone. Right. For right. real, everyone. Of course. Old families like ours should flock together, you know. Like birds. You're preaching, dear. Like birds? No, it's true. The Waynes and Zellerbachs are reminders of the golden age of Gotham. Oh, this city's luster faded years ago, Mr. Dent. Oh, I'm so Gotham excited to now. play Wolf Among Us. Murder in the streets, corruption in City Hall. I hear so many good things about freak, it. Dealing out vigilante justice like it's the wild goddamn West. Oh, Bobby, regarding Golden Age, seems you're getting cranky in yours. There's always hope. Forgive me for being blunt, but one man can't save this city. And it's a dangerous mentality to think so. That's how you get creeps like this Batman. Oh, I have hell to say no. I side with your wife on this, Mr. Zellerbach. He not Even bashing a spark back. Of hope can Batman, like, oh, an idealist with a bank account. He'll be broke before election day. <laughs> and I know Bruce would gladly spend every penny he has to fix this city. I don't doubt that for a moment. And don't worry though, I am not doing this alone. And with Bruce's help, we're replacing the dangerously unsecure Arkham Asylum. With a state-of-the-art mental health oh, facility shit. to help Gotham's Arkham most at-risk individuals. I wonder who's there. We'll be it's gotta be to Joker. And Martha maybe Wade Harley Quinn. In the hopes that their fate will never be repeated. Heck After yeah, all your parents did for this city, oh, to be killed in a botched robbery in some alleyway, it was terrible, truly terrible. Yeah, and tragedy like that at such a young age. Damn, they always bring up his parents. If only that uh, deranged man had gotten the right treatment, maybe... Uh, well, I don't like to think about maybes. And I'm sure you don't either. Well, Harvey is the one who's been behind the project since day one. A vote for him is a vote for the memory of my parents. You'll have it. Thank you. Thank you both. Mm, okay, Harvey will remember that. <laughs> Not saying I doubted you, but that went better than expected. It is a night of ringing endorsements. Uh oh, he gonna dance? Oh, well, hello. Harvey Dent, Gotham's next mayor, and eager to know you. Vicki Vale. <laughs> Not interested. And reporter for the Gotham Gazette. This is a private fundraiser, Miss Vale. No reporters allowed. Well, you don't mind if I stay and ask a few questions, do you, Mr. Wayne? Well, you can ask me uh, whatever you want at the press conference tomorrow. Actually, I'm here for Mr. Wayne. No, no, it's all right. You can stay. Thanks. Vicky, uh, stay? This is quite the social event, Mr. Wayne. Oh, come on now. So formal. Call me Bruce. Well, Bruce, you've been going around pleasing everyone tonight. But how are you doing? Oh, she you should really enjoy your own party before all the champagne runs out. Well, I'm doing better now that you're here. I'll <gasps> tell you if all oh, these stuff goes well, I'd give you the private tour. Playing Batman Arkham Knight on Xbox, hell yeah, Mr. Wayne. Love that game. You've got something on your collar. Um. <laughs> Is that blood? Yeah. It looks like. Oh, this? No, it's nothing. It just, uh. Yeah, cut himself cut shaving. Cut myself shaving. What? Your butler didn't help you this time? Hey, kidding. Kidding. <laughs> Do excuse me, Master Bruce, but, uh, another guest has arrived. I'm sure they'll find the bar. You may want to greet this one personally, sir. Carmine Falcone? <gasps> Is the Dent campaign soliciting votes oh, from Gotham's shit. biggest crime family? Falcone's never been convicted of anything except being a businessman who loves this city. Excuse us, Miss Vale. He's lying. This is a... We need to go investigate right now. <laughs> and what kind of business do you think he's in? The one that controls enough votes to get me into City Hall. This is the necessary evil of politics, Bruce. No, it's, it's not. It's in the service of this a better Gotham for all of us. Look, at least hear him out before you kick him out. Falcone requested to speak with you directly. Jesus, Harvey, inviting a known criminal to your fundraiser doesn't exactly look good for your squeaky clean image. Let me worry about that. A word of warning, Bruce? 
Word of warning? Play nice. And warning? Who is he warning? You know, I've been in the market like, is that a threat? Hunts. Decent walk up, sky high ceilings, plenty of room for my cars. I think I'll take it. Though the decor offends my eyes. Oh, man, all flash, no class. Let's talk privately. Let's talk privately, shall we? Hey, <laughs> I like this guy. Ready to do business before we even introduce ourselves. Yeah, we'll let's get, get to, to it. Come on, Falcone. Thank you for welcoming me into your home. Mm-hmm. Look, everybody's looking over like, what the fuck? You're a respectable man, I hear. Yeah. Batman and I here to play around. Perhaps we'll all be more comfortable in the parlor. Follow me, if you will. Damn, everybody was looking over to see if we was gonna shake hands. Uh, you should know, Shit. Mr. Falcone, my analysts say we're raising triple with Mayor Hill. At... Oh, see, he not even, look, he don't even, mm-hmm. You'll be fine out there, Harvey. I saw plenty of skirts to keep you busy for a few minutes. Harvey stays with us. A man's home is his castle. I respect that. Seen and not heard. Whatever ah, you... Ah, what did I say? Oh, shit. Seen but not heard, so he told him to shut his ass up. Mr. District Attorney here wants to make sure the rules are followed. What rules? But in my experience, there's the law, and there's doing what's right. You understand? And I'd rather see Harvey actually help this city instead of just saying he will. The man talks too much, chaps my face with words. Well, I would say you can uphold the law and still do what's right. To a point. Exactly. No one gets remembered for staying in the middle. Uh, Mr. Falcone, that's I've not no true. more warnings. I ain't here to chinwag about politics, Mr. Wayne. Gives me indigestion. I got enough of that as is. So what does he want to talk about? So, let's talk relationship. Chalk this for me. Be a pal. I can get Harvey the mayor's seat. Or I can pull it out from under him. Whatever happened to being a gracious host? I'm not chalking that okay, shit up. Okay, imagine. You. you do that this yourself. This is me. And these are all my friends in Gotham. The businesses, restaurants, clubs, docks, unions, politicians. If Harvey gets elected. What did he say? That's why I came here tonight to your lovely home, hoping to make a new friend. One who can help Mr. Dent see the light, if need be. Between your businesses and mine, I bet we employ half the city. We're not friends. Yeah, that's not happening. We're not friends. Hey, this isn't a deal with the devil. Yes, it is. You listen oh, to me, Oh, he mad kid. as hell. Oh, I know, somewhere we're inside not listening that tuxedo, to him. you understand this situation. Money gets money. The risks, the alliances, the hidden costs. Your father knew which hands to shake. Oh, hell no. Nah. Hell no. Nah. And which to break. I you think I'll go. have someone see you out. Okay. Okay. So that's how it's gonna be. Yeah. People don't say no to me. Oh, well, we just did, Not motherfucker. For long. Oh, look at Alfred Master coming Bruce, in here. Your guests are leaving. I recommend seeing them out. You wouldn't want to be rude. Heed your butler's advice, kid. Oh, and I'm no longer interested Alfred in the house. Alfred, a real one, for coming to check up on us. The owner's a prick. And he's gonna get what's coming to him. Shh.
Alright, did me. he recover? Like, is he good? From the intro? Man, he was like... Beaten up real bad. Oh, the Batmobile! Oh, heck yeah! Episode 1, let's do it. Thank you for the likes, I appreciate it, Tiger. Another brutal week in Gotham, folks. A string of home invasions rippled through the city's already crime-infested East End. We picked yellow Apparently, for the color. The are using stolen GCPD battery rams to force their way in. With breaking and entry incidents up... Oh, damn, he still has those? Year. Remember to keep those yeah. front doors locked tonight. And we have breaking news tonight. Five criminals are in custody this evening after a break-in at City Hall. But thanks to the efforts of the Batman, the stolen items were returned. Hey. Not all of them. Let's see what she was really after. Yeah. Catwoman has one, I think. Or we have it. Oh yeah, we have it. Does Hill's campaign really think these accusations hold any water with the voters? Be perceived as a desperate attempt from a flailing campaign to take down one of Gotham's most promising young politicians. And in other news, we are now on day three of the factory fire that will not end. Alfred Harvey, combat the blaze Hamilton, Cat Burglar, Catwoman, by Ace Chemical. Still no word on what started the fire, but whatever's burning in there has resisted everything the fire department has thrown at it. They're recommending people avoid the area Gotham and seek City, immediate treatment. Park in the Haven't sun. Breathe in any of that tar black smoke. And one mobster's murder caused quite a headache for commuters this morning. The body of Let's take a look at the data drive. Really fell off a building for this. Was found hanging off the side of the Fourth Street Bridge sometime just before dawn, causing traffic to back up for miles as the cops cut down. That's a bad computer. Random stabbings are the latest headache for the riders of Gotham's overcrowded Skyrail cars to contend with. Gotham police are investigating multiple cases of riders receiving abdominal wounds from an ice pick or other pointed weapon while pressed into the tight quarters with fellow passengers. Well, oh, these are the movie tickets. While most Poor have been Batman, to man. Gotham General in critical condition. The police don't have any suspects at the time. Two more patients have gone missing from Arkham Asylum, bringing the total number of escapees from the half prison, half mental hospital What's this, to the gadget team this year. Only three have been caught to date, but all the escapees highlight the rough spare grapple. Can't believe I let her take that. <laughs> the latest, That's what she took. Sister, Leon and Valerie Muldoon, be... I should see if I can refine the edge. Could be sharper. It's already sharp. Well, the test run at the mayor's office was a success. That was a test run? Can deliver a jolt or knock out electricity in the area. And I suppose that cat woman would have preferred the latter. The newest addition can program it to reveal trace elements in a confined space. Nice. you come home from work tonight and find all your stuff on the street, don't worry. Mayor Hill says he's tough on crime, but since his election, violence in Gotham has skyrocketed. Where is the computer? When he was presented with legislation that would have dismantled organized crime in the city, he vetoed it. Holographic lenses, voice modulation. Wayne Enterprises really outdid themselves with this version. Nice. I don't know, it's a distant area? Oh, there it is. Damn, Purple Connor would have been so cool. Encrypted. Encrypted. Wayne Manor has seven bedrooms, two kitchens, a library, a gymnasium, Damn, a basketball court, and a movie theater. And yet I always find you here. 
That's what we're in, in a dark, in dark damp theater? cave. In front of a computer. I'll leave as soon as I finish. People with regular jobs can do their work anywhere, but for me, this is my office. I agree. Yeah. It isn't normal work. Even worse, the best outcome is that no one ever finds out you've done it. Yeah, well, good deeds usually go unnoticed. Uh, though not unappreciated. Did you find out what that, um, cat woman tried to steal? Well, in the process. Seven bedrooms. What are we Damn. looking at? Let it's got a whole mansion. A different angle. Alright, so what was she looking for? This is a map of the east side shoreline. But it could mean any number of things. Money, weapons, drugs, everything flows through that port. Maybe it's where Mayor Hill picks up his dry cleaning. Hmm. Can't make sense of it yet. There's still plenty of files to decrypt. And in the meantime, I saved you what I could. Thanks, Al. Aww. Yeah, Al precares for him so much. Bar. I had to literally pry Mrs. Zeller back away. But you'll be pleased to hear everyone has left, including Mr. Falcone. Before the game switched from billiards to cutthroat. I'd recommend leaving the fist fights to your alter ego. Bloodstains are much harder to remove from a tuxedo. I don't want anything to do with Falcone. Well, he yeah, certainly we showed interest in you. That's what worries me. For the record, your father despised men like Falcone. Thought they ruined Gotham's stellar reputation. Back when it still had one? It can again, Bruce. Though people like this Catwoman aren't helping. Is she new to town? I've never seen her before. Oh, so he never seen Hopefully, that was his first she's time just with a tourist. Oh, no, I already checked the codex. Not much to find, apparently. A few burglaries, break-ins. I didn't know that was his first time uh, meeting Catwoman. Still pretty low. You could learn a thing or two from her. You can't step outside without it ending up in the news lately. Uh, As Bruce or Batman. I don't like being compared to a common criminal. No, I think you're missing the point. You have to admit you've been drawing a lot of attention to yourself. And not the playboy billionaire buys new yacht kind of attention. I don't Batman. mean to beat a dead argument, but... No one's gonna figure it out now. Trust me. Miss Vale noticed your injuries, so did Mr. Dent. If they put it together with the incident at the mayor's office, it would undo all the long nights and close calls we've endured to get here. You're in the spotlight more than ever. You have to be careful. I have a job to do. Okay, city a responsibility to this city. You know why I do this. For the car, I presume. Well, the car helps. Oh, yes, you drive that thing like a bat out of hell. is so sick. Uh, old men worry, that's all. It's our gift and our curse. One more worry for the list. Alfred's like kind of like his father figure, if you really think about it. Park, I 6 thought I saw Oz. It's been, what, 20 years? Last time I saw him, we were in grade school. Yo, hey, what's up? New gifter. Thank you so much. I appreciate Oswald, it. Oswald, however, took that role more literally than you. Dishonorable discharge, illegal boxing matches, arms dealing, prison stints? That's a criminal grand slam. If I'm using the expression correctly. Damn, a part of me wishes that are. we picked purple. Oswald claimed he only but wanted to catch it's up. Whatever. His behavior following his family's collapse is troubling. It looked kind of cool in blue, too. Now, I... What I'm happened? The idea. He needs money. It's not a coincidence. Give him a chance. I think he just wants to reconnect. Criminal record or not, he's still an old friend. A lot can change over the years. If I remember correctly, Oswald was fond of the old firecrackers in the toilet trick. I worry what he's graduated to. Hmm. Even though you and young Master Cobblepot used to be close, I'd advise you to be cautious. 
Okay, Alfred's right But I know right, you though. can't abandon a good mystery until it's solved. I'll be careful, Alfred. When you see what's become of his park, I think you will. Oh, shit. Thank you for the hearts. I appreciate it. I mean, <laughs> the roses. <laughs> Thank you for the roses. Cobblepot Park. Alright, let's see. Bruce is always wearing a suit. Where are you, Oz? Thank you for the likes. I appreciate it. Are we in the newspaper? We have to be. Wayne shuns Falcone. <gasps> it's in the news? Like, damn. Give change. Uh, thank you, sir. Is it cold outside? Running late, meet you by the statue. Great. Well, there's the statue, but no Oz. Yeah, because he's running late, no? See if he knows where Oz is. Okay, damn, what the hell? Established well, it isn't what it September twenty seventh. What does it say? Nineteen what? Watch wallet cash. But oh, this what the fuck? goes through you. Hey, you heard him, man. The hell are you waiting for? <laughs> Sorry, fellas. I've got nothing. You gave my change to the Damn other guy. Him. I don't think that's a good idea. Gentlemen! Oz. Keep walking, all right? This don't concern you, twerp! You see, that's where you're mistaken. My old mate and I have some catching up to do. And you're uh, in the moment! Oh, shit! Come here! Oh. Think that'll do! Oh. Stay oh, down! Oh, shit! Be a nice place. No lives like you don't belong. Damn. Oh fuck. This is my park. My. Oh shit, yeah. man. They was fucking them up. <laughs> oh, hey Bruce. You got a little uh. Yeah. Good as new. Woo! That was the right little scrap, eh? Nothing kickstarts the system like a dash of adrenaline, eh? Besides, someone needed to deal with the rubber situation here. Place is a dump. You went too far. You need to take it so far. Some folks are fine hearing, Bruce. Others don't get the message unless it's beaten into them. Damn, okay. All right. I mean, Batman kind of does the same thing, I Ten guess. Ten decades. And you know what? I haven't been mugged once that entire time. Um, we're streaming. We're just gonna stream episode uh, one. Because uh, I, I do have a closing man. shift tonight. Right now, 
I am trying to recognize the little Bruce I used to run around this place with. Back when it wasn't, you know. But I appreciate like this. you for stopping by. This park used to mean something. A place that was safe for kids, for families. People came from all over this. This is a shame you're right. Oh, mom and dad, they put so, so much work in here. Uh, I mean, he's uh, right, yeah. Those were better days. That they were. Yeah. Thought we'd grow up to be kings. Oh, I like got this. you, I got you. Both of us. <sighs> this city chews right through people. <sighs> Mum committed to Arkham. Dad. Ended it yourself, he did. My family's fortune. I got Nothing you. Nothing left, Bruce. I know. Alfred told me. <sighs> it's funny, huh? Same place that ground my family to dust. Gave you the good life. Used to run in the same circles we did. Hobnobbing parties, round the world vacations, unlimited potential. I'm... I'm sorry, Arthur. Damn, we gotta apologize no to No one should have to go through that. Thanks, Bruce. But we are not Appreciate the only ones suffering. Good to know you haven't changed, Bruce. You still care about something more than just yourself. Although, I was surprised to see Carmine Falcone at your party last night. Made himself right at home. That's just politics? That he wasn't boy. invited? That's <sighs> not what you think. Wish I could have punched that grin into the back of his throat. No, 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 no. I only agreed to meet him because of Harvey. Beware of any man who smiles that much, Bruce. They're usually hiding a forked tongue. Falcone made a stack of cash and corpses a mile high, ruining families like mine. All he needs is a little push. We didn't do no business and with him. It'd be a treat to watch him at pavement. What? Sorry, mate. This reunion got a lot more grim than I planned. Things are gonna be on the upswing soon, no? A revolution is knocking on the Love that. And I'm here to let it in. Which brings me to you, Bruce. You see, you throw a rock in any direction, you break a window that Wayne Enterprises owns. As the rich and powerful go, oh, you top Gotham's list. But when my revolution starts, we're gonna smash windows and cross off names all the way down. Like I said, it's not going to be pretty. It's going to be beautiful. Not I'm your not enemy. your enemy, Oz. That remains to be seen, don't it? I've got great affection for you, Bruce. I really do. Which is why I'm warning you. When this whole thing starts, make sure you're on the right side. Good seeing you, Bruce, but... I got some rocks to collect. Cheers. Shit. I mean, he kind of like warned us. Press conference for new hospital start soon. Car waiting for the south. Damn, he's doing all like this press too. Enterprises. Damn, look at that car, yo. The Bruce Wayne has showed Mr. up. Mr. Wayne, over here. Right here. This way. Oh, Harvey don't look happy. Bruce, Bruce. Good morning, everyone. Morning, Mr. Dent. Hey, Bruce, you mind if we swap cars? I mean, mine isn't fast and the paint's rusting off, but boy, does she have charm. <laughs> uh, we didn't bring you all out here to discuss cars, honestly. <sighs> now, we're here about Arkham Asylum. Ever since it opened its doors, Arkham has been a breeding ground for the criminally insane. Its methods for rehabilitation, crude. Its security, lacking. 
And the rate of death and suicide inside the asylum itself is truly terrifying. And worse still, those who do get out, or God forbid escape, are even more dangerous yeah, than before they went in. Arkham Asa? Asylum is a cancer on Gotham. <clears throat> but today, with a sizable contribution from this man here, we break ground on a state-of-the-art mental health care facility. One that will improve the well-being of Gotham and its citizens for years to come. Now, Mr. Wayne has a few words he'd like to say. Oh, Bruce? we gotta make it short and quick. My parents loved Gotham. They invested their blood, sweat, and tears in this city. <sighs> you know, when I was uh, nine years old, my parents took me to see a movie about a hero in a mask. It was a hero who stood up to oppression and defended the people from injustice, Aww. no matter the cost. That night, my parents paid the ultimate cost defending me from a man <clears throat> who needed the kind of help this new facility will provide. With this facility and our next mayor, we'll put a dent in we crime. can put a dent in crime. Today, on the anniversary of that fateful night, we dedicate this facility to Thomas and Martha Wayne and usher in a new era of healing for Gotham. Why, they didn't like that I said that we could put a dent I'm in crime? Uh, Sure, you all have plenty of questions about the new hospital, so let's open it up. You first, Miss Vale. Thank you. With the opening of this oh, new Vicky? hospital, what does this mean for Arkham Asylum? What happens to the old building? Uh, leave it standing. I say we leave the asylum standing as a reminder that we can do better. This time, we won't fail those who need us most. We All right, who's up next? Oh, Wayne, uh, you there. Mr. Wayne, Julia Remark of the Tribune. My sources say you welcomed alleged mob boss Carmine Falcone into your home. You and Mr. Dent even spoke with him behind closed doors. He's no I don't friend. make friends with gangsters. He was an unwelcome guest. That's all. Next question, please. Please, keep your questions on topic, people. We're here about the hospital, remember? Uh, but Mr. Wayne, this morning the Globe the received GCPD evidence of an offshore bank account managed by Carmine Falcone and your father, Thomas Wayne. What exactly are you implying? Transactions connected to organized crime going back years and continuing to this day. The paper trail ties your family directly to the mob. Care to comment? How dare you? I and doubt did anyone else this. receive this evidence? The Globe, the Gazette, we all did. Mr. Wayne, oh, Mr. Mr. Wayne, is all your money dirty? Is the Wayne family legacy built on lies? Did you know about this, Bruce? How long has your family been dealing with Falcone? Could the allegations be true? What are you telling us? Does the mob sign Wayne Enterprises' paychecks? Right, this press conference is over. Mr. Wayne, Mr. Wayne! How long has your family been dealing with Falcone? What the Could the allegations be true? Did you know about this, Bruce? What are you telling us? Damn, I'm sorry they got this, a... Bruce. I don't know where the hell it's coming from. Damage controls my territory. We'll talk later. Everyone, everyone, please settle down. I'll be fielding Yo, your questions we gotta from here on phone. out. Please, let's try to keep this civilized. Bruce, I've been trying to reach you. The police are inside the manor. Oh shit, meet the press. Damn, yo, they were they were aggy asking all those questions. Hey, hey, careful. Put it back. I'm afraid we can't, stuff. Mr. Wayne. Says who? This warrant. It's not personal. I had the boys turn the lights off, keep a low profile. There's got to be a mistake. That's what we're here to find out. Maybe we made a mistake. Maybe you did. Alfred, 
Keep an eye on them. Make sure they only take what they have to. Of course, sir. Yeah, what the hell? I meant what I said about not person. We only want files related to Wayne Enterprises. The warrant covers your place, pardon me, places of residence, and any companies you own. Who authorized, Who authorized this? this? I know you and the DA are buddy buddy, but this one came from the top. Which it's a valid warrant. I gotta serve it. Mayor Hill signed off on this himself. <gasps> as long as he's mayor, he calls the shots. Well, Hill has a history of making his opposition disappear. Rumors hey, what's up? What game is this? We're playing uh, Batman the Telltale but series. But if they become fact, I'll handcuff him myself, same as any other crook. I don't know how your neck ended up on Mayor Hill's shopping block, but here we are. Hill knows if I go down, Harvey's campaign goes down too. Batman, yeah. Shame. Mr. Dent's the only DA I ever trusted to make a conviction stick. As mayor, I think he can finally turn things around for us. For all our sake. You know it, you I know it. You've got nothing to hide. Thanks for sharing the live, I appreciate you. Oh, did they break something? Wow, he didn't even pick, he didn't even pick it up. Damn. That's what they broke? Mother effers. Bruce, stay back! Take whatever you want! You... You don't have to do this. Sad for him. Bruce? How the hell did she get in here? I I didn't mean to interrupt, but how'd you get in here? I'm a bit busy right now, Miss Vale. As you can see, Gotham's finest, not the best house guests. Yeah, the kind of steal things. Listen. Bruce, a scandal surrounding a beloved family like yours captures the public's attention. I can help you get the right kind of attention. Through my connections at the Gazette, I have all kinds of access. I can dig up whatever you need to fight this. What's your angle? What's your angle? Not all reporters just want a headline. Some of us are old-fashioned. I still want the truth. Mm. The Gazette received this supposed evidence like every other media outlet, and it's all hearsay flimsy sources there isn't a shred of hard proof still allegations like this they, they they don't magically appear someone is going after my family after me obviously the sender didn't identify themselves we have no idea who it could be i mean no one's even done their due diligence on this yet it's media the press saw the fumble they grabbed this? the ball and ran not every day you get to go after a wayne Carmine Falcone wants me to be in his pocket. He crashed Harvey's fundraiser and pretty much said, Yeah, and he was in. mad that we didn't know. Well, uh, maybe he thinks putting a little fear in you will make you jump. We didn't do business with him. By tonight, this scandal will be broadcast to every screen in Gotham. Everyone will be talking about it. This isn't my first pass through the rumor mill. I know the damage it can do. Then go on the record. Right here, right now, and stop it. You need to get out ahead of this. Your side is what matters, not wild speculation. She's on right. the record, then. Whenever you're ready. Whoever fabricated these lies about my family, they will get what they deserve. Understood? That's exactly what the people of Gotham need Vicky to hear. Vicky will remember that. You're gonna beat this, Bruce. The Waynes always come out on top. Goodbye, Miss Rail. What does Alfred think of her? I hate to admit it, but everyone smells smoke. A fire is heading this way. Batman has made plenty of enemies, but my family? 
We've done nothing but support Gotham, even in its darkest days. All this on the anniversary of your parents? It's not a coincidence. Harvey's the district attorney. He should have told me this was coming. Then find out why he didn't. Harvey's toothpaste! A warrant? What the hell's going on? Wait, does this have to do with what the reporters were talking about this morning? You need to fix I'm this. I'm in a lot of trouble, Harvey. And I need your help to get me out of it. Yes, of course. Of course, whatever I can do. The fuck? Mayor Hill authorized this? Yeah, then the cops raid my house, taking everything related to Wayne Enterprises. Computers, hard drives, files... Oh, son of a bitch. You're the goddamn DA, Harvey. I didn't know about this, I swear. Hill totally blindsided me on this one. God damn it. Enough well, that's just not good enough, Harvey. Listen, I'll look into this, I swear. I just don't get it. Why would Hill stick his He's neck out? He's two-faced! Just to tangle you up in some frivolous investigation? That just doesn't make sense. I mean, what could he possibly hope to accomplish other than a few cheap headlines? Do you think Falcone could be behind it? He didn't seem too thrilled after the fundraiser. Ah, oh, God, what a mess. Bruce, I wish I could just make this go away, but I'm not sure if I can. If I get in the way of this investigation, oh I'll we'll be God. able to spin it as a conflict of interest. Yeah, okay. We're and done that with that wouldn't be good for either of us. It would jeopardize the entire campaign. I'm doing myself then. Then I'll go it alone. I've got plenty of resources to fight this. We're in a bind here, Bruce. I'll do whatever I can to help. There you are. Hey, you. <gasps> Sorry. I got a habit of being late. No, no, just glad Her you made eye. it. Her eye! <laughs> That's Catwoman! <gasps> oh, she knows! Oh, fuck! You didn't tell me you were bringing a friend to dinner. This is Selena. I hope I'm not interrupting anything. Just election nonsense. Harvey never mentioned you before. Oh, really? That's interesting. Mm -hmm. What was your name again? Uh, it's Selena. Selena Kyle. It's a strong grip you've got there. Oh, shit! Don't worry. I'm not gonna fall. Oh, right. Sorry. Oh, shit! She Selena's knows. new to town. I've been showing her around Gotham, introducing her to people. You're an excellent tour guide, Harv. Well, if I lose the election, I guess I can drive one of those to double decker town. tour buses around town. So, Miss Kyle, what brings you to Gotham? Business. Well, Business. Let's just hope she stays after what happened last night. I was mugged. I'm just angry I let that masked freak get away with all my stuff. I still can't believe I let you walk home alone. I should have called you a car. What did you lose? Well, I sure hope whatever he took wasn't too valuable. Actually, it was. It's probably long gone by now. Whatever that idiot took. I hope not. These were important materials. Ooh. Sensitive? Very. Oh! I don't know how I'm gonna explain this to my client. When things like this happen in my line of work... People tend to overreact. What is it that so, you do? So, what do you do for a living? It's complicated. High risk, high reward. Ah, stock market, huh? <laughs> Something like that. Uh -oh. At least I'm not the only one who's taken a beating. That press conference? Oof. We've got it under control. Do you? The freak? I'll handle it. Someone at my office has to know what's going on. Uh, excuse me a moment. Hey, it's Harvey. Uh oh. Uh oh. It's just us two. Nice to meet the real you. Uh oh. Likewise. This explains a lot, actually. 
How you can afford the fancy armor, the Thank toys. You. Wouldn't Harvey be surprised? <laughs> Not to mention everyone in this cafe. Sorry about the black eye. It's not the first time a man's hit me. No I'm sorry shit. to hear that. Don't worry. I'm not gonna expose you. Yet. Yet? I'm curious about something, though. I do what I do for money, but you're... Bruce Wayne. Yeah, he's already rich. What's your excuse? I have to. But you... Why take the risk? I think you know enough already. The rest is my secret. And here I was thinking we were starting to get somewhere. How disappointing. Oh. You have something that belongs to me. I want it back. This is awkward for me. Yeah. I'm used to robbing people, not the one being robbed. Who hired you? Who hired you to break into the mayor's office? My clients prefer to remain confidential. They don't know who I am, I don't know who they are. But you really? know who I am. These people I'm working for, they don't screw around. If I fail to deliver that drive, it's gonna cost a lot more than money. Well, looks like you've made your bed. No, we've made this bed. And I'm not gonna lie in it alone. You owe me. If they don't get what they want, there will be consequences. I don't like consequences. Oh, you don't need my help. You seem pretty capable of handling this yourself. Oh, I intend to. Just give me back the drive and I'll be on my merry little way. Yeah, I'd rather not. Listen, <laughs> I don't have a lot of time. My employer is expecting me to drop it off. Where? Just give it back. The address, now. No, give me the drive. No, we're not giving it to you. You're just going to have to trust me. I don't do trust. I guess I'm screwed either way. My contact. He'll be expecting a cat, not a bat. When are you supposed to meet him? Fifteen minutes ago. Oh, shit. Better hurry. Everything okay here? You tell me. I have my people working on it. We're gonna straighten everything out. Uh -huh. I feel better already. That Sorry, tension was I insane, though. So soon? Aren't you gonna stay for a drink? Yeah, Bruce. Stay for a drink? <laughs> I'd love to, but I've got another appointment and I really don't want to be late for it. Oh, all right then. Don't forget to change into your suit. Oh. Oh, why did you do that? <laughs> don't screw it up. Shit, at least she gave us the address. Alfred, I'm at the warehouse. No sign of Catwoman's contact. It's quiet. The sound of an ambush. Stay on guard. I love that interaction, though. That was unexpected. wasn't a handoff. It was a massacre. How many? I'd have to count the pieces. Oh, oh. good lord. Who could have done such a thing? That's what I'm gonna find out. Gordon, Eastside Docks, Warehouse 133. Damn, there's scratch marks? Analyzing. It's a volatile chemical. Potential psychoactive nerve agent. Vile stuff. Be very, very careful with that. Who knows what effect it may have. Have the computer catalog the compound for further analysis. As you wish. Nothing left uh, to bury. That's fucked up. What 
whoever exploded did so with enough force to obliterate the person standing next to it. Oh, but the shit. chemicals themselves were inert, not explosive. Well, it appears to have made a pretty big boom. I'll see what I can piece back together. All right, let's see. I've seen these outfits before. Yeah, we saw them in the intro. That broke into City Hall. canister exploded, sending shrapnel right through the container door. For once, I'm glad you arrived after the heist. Shit. Your armor wouldn't have protected you against that. Oh, what is this over here? Something was here when the explosion occurred. So what was it? Someone drove off after the explosion. Right, someone drove off. Falcone's calling card. He's been busy as of late. So it had to be Falcone. I want to know his every move. Good thinking, sir. No. That bad? Oh, fuck. Face slashed. Throat torn open. So, not natural causes then. Skylight Club. has been badly burned, but the damage seems to originate from inside his skull. Holy shit! What did this? Oh! Oh shit, we have to do that? Oh fuck, that's fucked up! Sensors say it's an incendiary route. Phosphorus residue. This could have superheated the contents of the canister. Causing the aforementioned boom. Blood. Broken nails. Damn. Bits of human flesh. Holy shit. Guys fight? A cop shredded this murk to oh, pieces. Oh. Barehanded. God. What would cause someone to do that? The nerve agent. Oh, that's why the flesh psychotic. is under his nails. Alright, then what caused this? The hell? Is this what caused the explosion? What, like, what made it, like, go up? Oh, we didn't examine this. Hmm. 
canisters were stored here. Canisters of what? Shit, we don't know. It's a cop. The force grows thinner every day. Just one more connection, but like to what? Alright, I don't know. Let's open this up. Looks like a bullet started this. A normal bullet couldn't have caused that explosion. Doesn't appear normal. The point of entry's melted. Alright, so... Does that link to the guy's... head? Find a connection. The bullet that killed the cop is the same type that blew up the canister. Oh shit, okay. Well, I'm sure they didn't find that at the local gun store. It appears military. Have you put it together? Yes. Oh nice, so let's see how it played out. Falcone leaving his rose here. This is a message. Dead cops, stolen chemicals. That's fucked up. He's making a big move. Yeah, the cops tried. Oh, bro. It didn't turn out well for them. One of his snipers hit a canister with an incendiary bullet, causing it to superheat and explode. This may have been a distraction or a way of destroying evidence. Cops moved in to stop the theft. Falcone's men. Damn, got the just job. shot. Oh, fuck. Then things turn grim. Possibly due to the psychoactive nerve agent. A cop oh, ripped up a merc's shit. face with his bare hands. That was insane. And was put down. Same sniper, same type of bullet. Looks like Falcone's men got what they wanted and escaped. Have you located the shooter? No. But based on two impact trajectories, the canister and the dead cop, the shooter could only have a clear shot from there, yeah, there, from above. or there, and would have contaminated himself with the phosphorus residue. Program the skimmers to pick up that signature. Right away, sir. Oh, shit. All right, so we're going to track him down. Targets could have been shot from here, but no phosphorus trace. All right, so this is in it. Over there, maybe? Oh, we found it. For a spike. Found Clear it. vantage point. We have a winner. This is the right spot. So where did he go? Yeah, where did he go? Did he jump off the ledge? Cigarette. Hmm. <laughs> Killing time. Trace stops here. Then he should be nearby. Oh shit, he's still in here. Found him. Time to go to work. World's greatest detective. Nice. Or is he dead? He's gotta be dead. My turn. Oh shit. 
Don't make me add your corpse to this graveyard. No, Coney. Why did he do this? I, I ain't telling you nothing. <laughs> you, you can't make me talk. Shit. <laughs> I ain't telling you, Jack. You trying to scare a confession out of me? I won't break. Your bones will. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Holy shit. True He's gonna hit him with that you. shit? You're a freaking animal. Time to live up to my reputation. You know, you can bleed to death without ever spilling a drop. Damn. All on the inside. Tell me the plan, or I start swinging. I ain't scared of you, man. <laughs> Tell me. That cab woman supposed to hand over a drive had the container number we needed but she flaked so we had to find it ourselves uh, container by container uh, someone must have heard us called the cops we were told no witnesses my wrist open war with the gcpd some kind of chemicals <laughs> Falcone wanted them what are the chemicals for we were paid to steal them not ask questions <laughs> Oh shit! I start here and keep breaking until you answer. The chemicals is some kind of explosive, a weapon. I don't know. Balcony said he'd use them. Soon. Used where? Break his arm! Break his arm! I swear! I swear! Break it! You'll never hold a gun steady again. Damn. Jesus Christ. These are cops. We gotta get out of here. I think I need to call the coroner instead. I was wrong. I'm gonna need that ambulance too. You're gonna think it's Batman. What the hell's going on tonight, Lieutenant? Batman. Shit. Lieutenant Gordon noticed your violence. You're taking this too far, Bruce. Shit. You assume the persona of a bat, but you're not an animal. You nearly killed a man tonight. I mean, did we? Your parents didn't raise you this way. And neither did I. He's still alive. He's still alive, isn't he? And in the hospital. <sighs> Next time, it might be the morgue. Especially now, during this preposterous attack on your family. You must show the world the true nature of a Wayne. Giving everything to the city and then being murdered for it? My thoughts exactly. Every time you leave this cave. Yeah. You're a good man, Bruce. Good. Just like your parents. Don't lose that. I don't mean to be a doddering old fool on the subject, but as a friend, the burden of advice falls on me. Sometimes this job requires hard decisions. You're the right man to make them. In fact, I think you're the only one who can. You bury the person, Bruce, but you never bury the memory. Shit. Sometimes I wish I could. That night, that alleyway, it made me who I am. I can't get it out of my head. That is your gift and your curse. Being Batman can allow you to turn back the tide of treachery that's reached this city's shores. How would we get like another suit? Sorrow. That would be so cool if we can get when another suit. When you doubt suit. your fate, Remember why you started all this. Remember that boy in the alley. I won't forget. 
Neither will I. Damn, who would have refused it? Well, back into the fray again. Looks like that egg finally cracked. And inside, Mayor Hill was hiding... more than I could have imagined. This is a complete manifest of Carmine Falcone's criminal organization. What in the world was Hill doing with all this? Illegal arms dealing, drug running, mob hits, money laundering? Falcone's been involved in everything. You see Dad's name on any of these documents? I'll run a search, but so far I don't. Oh. This is it, Alfred. With this proof, we can Damn, finally knock out Falcone's organization. Where would we possibly begin to dismantle it? This is a police matter. There's only one cop we can trust to handle this evidence correctly. Lieutenant Gordon. He could mobilize the entire police force against Falcone. But Gordon doesn't trust us right now. Reporter from the Gazette. Vicky. Yes, uh, Miss Vale. She could release this evidence through proper channels. I suppose it comes down to who you want to help most. I mean, do we trust do Vicky, though? Do I don't good. know if we do. The cops are on the front lines of We're this We're gonna war. give it to Gordon. Gordon needs this more than anyone. For real. A wise decision, sir. We'll attack Falcone on two fronts tonight. Gordon through the police, and Batman by any means necessary. Whatever Falcone is planning, it ends tonight. Oh, He's shit. He's spider, Bruce. Eyes everywhere. A dense web of goons poised to trap you. No one has ever managed to bring him down. I haven't tried yet. Oh, shit. Bad go. Love Batman. I trust Gordon. It's just Gordon doesn't trust us just yet. This. This is a silver bullet. And it's gonna put Falcone down once and for all. I don't even want to know where you got this. No, you don't. Still, I gotta know one thing. Why give this to me? Don't get me wrong. I appreciate the hell out of this. I trust you. I heard you. you were the last honest man on the force. No need to blow smoke. Bat go. Love <laughs> well, bat go. Thank you. Honestly. He took Knowing notice. this evidence can lock up Falcone. <laughs> I'll sleep like a goddamn baby. For once. You know, as much as I appreciate you calling me here, I gotta make one thing crystal. I can't be bought. Okay. All right. So you should know this isn't gonna change a thing about the investigation of your family. Okay. The Wayne's always supported the Gotham police. So I'd like to believe there's no cloaks or daggers hidden in your closet. The investigation isn't the problem. It's the Wayne family name. Help me clear it. If your family's clean, I'll sing it from the rooftops. If they aren't, I'll still sing. <laughs> you gotta understand, I'm bound to this badge. Understood. He's an honest man. Gotta we gotta go. respect that. Came straight from a crime scene. Haven't been home yet. Sometimes I think this whole city's a crime scene. We're just walking through it. What you're holding will make walking it much safer. Thanks, Bruce. That's true. Well, Lieutenant. Hey, 
Stick to Jim. <laughs> All right, Jim. It's done. Good. So is our hunt. The drones located Falcone downtown, a place called the Skyline Club. Though you're not dressed for that kind of party. Well, I can always change in the car. Damn, he's got a nice ass car. Wait a second, did it just turn to the Batmobile? Holy shit, it did. Nice. Nice. <laughs> it changed into the Batmobile. That was awesome. Cameras and scanning tech are fully functional. All right. Let's find Falcone. Good point of entry. What's the difference between the Mafia and City Council? I don't know. Aren't they the same thing? That's a nice car, right? Mm, he's got a real oh. nice car. And I <laughs> love that too. it just turns right into the uh, Batmobile. You alone? Not anymore, I'm not. Where's Nikki? In lockup. Again? Christ, Kimmy. What did they pinch him for now? Some hit down at the docks. Nikki? No. I didn't think he was a hatchet man. You and me both. Well, does he got an alibi? Honey, I'm always his alibi. Oh, uh, where else? What is this? You make your round? Yeah, oh, people at the no bar. No broken bones. Still yelling from the last time, I bet. Mm, all it took was a couple of C notes this time. Nice and easy. Nice and easy, my ass. I know Thanks for the like, Terry. Appreciate it. Whole city can smell it. Nothing here. <laughs> so why did you give us the option to look at it? It's funny. Office. That's the most heavily guarded door in the building. Yeah, that's gotta, gotta be, gotta be it. Hideout. Well, it won't be as easy as ringing the doorbell. Four armed guards. Damn. We can Stealth see all that. Option. I'll put together a plan of attack. Stand by. <laughs> Excuse me. A couple of options for taking this guy down. How much does he have in his bank account? He has mad money. He's about to take these guys out so bad. And this guy right here. This one might be tricky. Any ideas? I've got it covered out. Oh, 
Alright, let's do this. Hell yeah. Bruce, have you formulated your plan of attack? Yes, we have. I'm going, going in. in. Very good, sir. Your turn to crash in. Hell yeah, eye. let's do this. Stay down, Falcone. We can end this now. You got a lot to learn, kid. The freak? Explosives armed. Fire when ready. Nice. Nice, we gotta get him before he gets up. your calling card at the docks. The white rose. You think I wanted to lead you here? <laughs> yeah, Damn. something reeks about this old thing. And it ain't a dead bat. Still want to play games? We're all being played here, including you. Unless chemicals get so riled up about that mine, all right? Someone is trying to cut me out of the deal. Ooh. I did not make that mess at the dock. Then who did? No, we're done. Gotham's watching now. Ah. Go ahead. Give him a show. Rest <laughs> Spill it, 
Balcony, while you still can. <laughs> it's... It's who? The Waynes. <laughs> They're behind all this. Uh-uh, that's not you true. Mean? You want to save this city? Well, the Waynes are the biggest gangsters in Gotham. <laughs> nah, that's not true. No way. Thanks for the assist. Now we only have to take one of you down. Open fire! smoke could reportedly be seen from street level tonight the skyline club a high-rise mafia hangout in downtown gotham was the arena for a clash between the notorious batman and alleged mob boss carmine falcone who was found dangling over a 50-story drop bet falcone loved that view though i'd say the crime boss getting his is well overdue falcone has slipped through the law's grasp for years but after this dramatic arrest and evidence released by the GCPD's Lieutenant Gordon, Falcone's going away for a long, long time. Heck yeah! And speaking of newly See ya, Falcone. criminal dealings, this brings me to the story everyone is talking about. The Wayne family. For generations, the big W on the Wayne Enterprises Tower was a reassuring sight. You knew that there was something Damn, look at his car. of Gotham. That this city, for all its faults, was built by good people. But with Thomas and Martha's shining reputation called into question, we no longer have such assurances. And even worse, it seems the apple hasn't fallen far from the tree. Gotham's greatest son, Bruce Wayne, seen here in the company of gangsters, may be just as crooked as his parents. In his defense, Wayne fired back saying, Whoever fabricated these lies about my family, they will get what they deserve. Understood. In a world where the Waynes, our golden family, are corrupt, who are we left with? Damn. Who can Gothamites look up to? The supposed hero Batman? Only time will tell. Meanwhile, we'll keep digging for the truth. But the prominent feeling throughout Gotham is that the Waynes' time Damn, of sun worried, is like, ending. Worried for Bruce. Damn, look how he enters the Batcave. This entire cave. Master Bruce? Everything I built. I created all of this because I didn't want any more innocent people to die. Damn. If Falcone's telling the truth about my parents, then what the hell did we do this for? Bruce, I... What have you been hiding from me? Alfred! Damn, he's mad. He's heartbroken, too. Crushed. You and 67% of players defy Falcone by inviting Harvey into the private meeting? Okay, yeah, yeah. We was like, what the fuck? Harvey comes with us. Did you provide a quote for Vicky's story? 85% of us did. Good. Did you break the dock shooter's arm? 51% did it? Damn. We did, man. 48% of us did break the arm. Who did you give Falcone the Falcone data to? Who the hell chose Vicky? <laughs> what? Like, Gordon's the GOAT. How did Batman deal with Falcone at the end? You and 82% of players showed resistance and handed Falcone over to the police safe and sound. Nice. All right, let's see what we got next when your time on parents died, episode two. They left me as caretaker of their estate, their son, and their secrets. I would never betray them. Your parents were good people, Bruce, no matter what that thug Falcone told you. Then swear to me, there's no truth to it. 
The evidence you brought me on Falcone held yeah, up. Yeah, what kind of evidence do they have? Now Batman's beating up mobsters too. Wonder who he's after next. Hell of a view. Oh shit. Bruce, the Wayne name is toxic. I have to do what's best for my campaign. What's best for Gotham? Oh look, he reunites with Catwoman. I have to <gasps> distance myself. Oh. Ah. I will find the truth. Along with anyone who stands in my way. Uh, not now, yeah. I was gonna ask him to get the season pass. That was really, really awesome, y'all. Uh, I really enjoyed it. Um, we're gonna go ahead and call it a stream here, but that was so much fun. I appreciate every single one of you for stopping by the stream. But uh, yeah, episode one is done. We're gonna go ahead and upload it on YouTube as well. But I uh, appreciate y'all for coming on by, and I hope to see y'all next time. Until then, peace out, y'all.